From life in the streets to life under a roof, nearly 300 people have now moved into two hotels the city of San Diego bought and converted into permanent housing last year. ABC 10 News reporter Anthony Pura spoke with someone who's benefited from it so far. Once hotel rooms, the units inside this former residence inn on Hotel Circle have been transformed into apartments for people like Anita Wiggins. I'm excited, I'm ecstatic, um, I mean, I, ooh, uh. She gets emotional when talking about having a home. She became homeless in 2017. I've been on every park and every beach and sleeping out there on the streets. The 59-year-old is one of many people, once homeless, that the city has moved from the convention center into permanent supportive housing at two former hotel locations. The city bought and transformed two residence inns late last year, one in Mission Valley and another in Kearney Mesa. In December, they started moving people in. The residents have a support system and services in place to help them adjust to life away from the streets and lead them away from paths that could return them to homelessness. They take me to the grocery store. I'm grateful for that. If I need a bus pass, which I really do, they, they have those for us. They have food for us. They have counseling for us. According to the San Diego Housing Commission, out of the 332 available units at the two properties, 265 units are occupied. 290 individuals have moved in. The hotels were purchased with the help of funding from the state's Project Home Key. Lisa Jones with the San Diego Housing Commission says if more funding becomes available through the state, they want to be ready. One of the things that happened with the last round of Home Key is that we actually started looking at acquisitions as far back as April of last year. So when that Home Key funding came in, we were one of the first applicants um, in the cycle. Jones says they are looking at two sites closely, but couldn't specify any locations. Anthony Pura, ABC 10 News.